I'm gonna go ahead and finish, you know, eat my food. Because your girl is hungry. Not gonna eat. You know, when you don't eat, you got an attitude. I can't go on the road with no attitude. I gotta eat. I just be going, doing my own thing. You know. Man, I'm just trying to be me, homie. This ain't what you see on TV. That life ain't nothing like reality. Man, I'm just trying to be me. I'm just trying to be me. I'm just trying to be me. I'm just trying to be. Man, I'm just trying to be me. I ain't faking, I ain't fucking for the fame. When I make it, want a damn thing change. Man, I'm just trying to be me. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl, Jasmine Vibrant Peace. And guess what? Yo, girl, made it to two months, two months in the car, and I'm super proud of myself, super duper proud of myself. It seems like it's going by even faster because it feels like I just literally recorded my video of me staying in my car for one month, and now here it is already at two months. I'm currently at work, and I'm on, oh, God, that just hit me. I'm on break at work, um, so I figure let me go ahead and record my video while I have the time because, like, my schedule has been literally all over the place, so, um. Um, yeah, I'm super duper excited guys. It has been one month like well one extra month from last month Like it has been another month basically and I'm so excited And thank you guys so much for following me on this journey. I'm super duper excited I, I have so much more to come like oh my god It seems like everything is happening so fast like so fast and I'm just so proud of myself that I got this far so my lunch is only 30 minutes long, so I'm gonna try to eat and record this video at the same time. Let me grab a fork. Before I started staying in my car, y'all, I used to always be like, dang, I forgot to, to bring a fork. Or, it's not my light showing out. The sun's probably about to set or whatever. Um, I'd be like, dang, y'all, I forgot to bring a fork or I forgot to grab something to drink. But now, you know, I'm in my car. Your girl got a fork, you know, and her drinks <laughs> come real in handy. All right, it's already here. It's already here. And yesterday, my best friend met me with some food. And um, I'm super duper excited because I've been like not dying for a home cooked meal, but I've been wanting a home cooked meal, you know. So I said, please. You know, bring me some food. So she got me some food, so I'm having that for lunch today. And um, yesterday on my way back from uh, meeting her, I actually got stuck in traffic and I was so hungry. I was like, oh my God, I would hate to get off, you know, off the interstate, they have to jump back on. It's gonna put my time back even more. But you know, since your girl right here in the car, she had everything available. Everything was right here. So I had some cereal that, um, I had some granola bars in my cooler back here, so I just, you know, ate on those until I got to my location where I was going. So that came in handy as well. So this, honestly, this past month, everything has literally been coming in handy for your girl. Like when I wanted to travel, I went out of town twice. I went out of town three times, three times last month. Yeah, three times, and what i realized and it felt so good because i didn't have to go home to pack a bag to get on the road like everything was literally here it was already in my car i was good i was ready to go so that was just like a plus for me like a plus and it cut down so much time because honestly i would have gotten home and i would have to go through my closet and y'all have a lot of clothes i would have to go through my closet and like find clothes and it would be so bad because i would literally take maybe two hours and i could have already been at my destination or close to my destination but i had to go home and you know pet so staying in my car it minimizes all that it cuts all that time out for me i don't have to do all that extra this everything right here hmm and if it ain't in this car obviously i don't need it y'all this food so good mm! so good i love macaroni and cheese love macaroni and cheese so much all right so let me turn my camera a little bit because i've noticed like my focus be going in and out it be trying to focus on my um does that work it be trying to focus on my um 
be trying to focus on my steering wheel. I don't know. I need to learn more about my camera and how to make sure I'm setting it at the settings correctly for when I am um, recording my videos. But yeah, mm, y'all, so good. This month, I did notice that I'm spending a lot more money on gas. Like, a lot of my money is going towards ga gas, but it's still less than $800 a month for rent. You know what I'm saying? So, I really have to, what I've learned is, I sit in my car, and I just let my car run. Oh, excuse me. I just let my car run, and I'm just like, girl, cut the car off. Okay, y'all, this is going to be kind of difficult eating and talking at the same time, because food is just flying everywhere. Hey, I'm going to eat it. But, yeah. So I feel as if I, I've learned that I need to turn my car off when I'm just sitting in places. Like, because I would just sit and scroll on my phone for like a good 40 minutes and forget my car running. Mm -hmm. Turn it off. Save your gas. I also learned in this month that your girl is tired of eating out. I'm tired. I'm tired of eating out. I want a home cooked meal. A home cooked meal. So anytime like any of my family members are cooking, I go to their house and get a plate. Uh, we got a family group chat and I'm texting like, who cooking? Can I come get a plate? Seriously, because your girl be hungry. But yeah, I'm so like, you know, I, I don't mind eating out every now and again. But sometimes you just want that home cooked meal, y'all. Like seriously. And when I stayed in my apartment, I didn't know how to cook. So I was still always eating out a lot. But I would still be able to cook like certain things like Alfredo, pork beans and rice. If you country, you know what I'm talking about. Okay, because that's the business right there. But yeah. So I didn't really cook as much when I stayed in my apartment. So I thought, you know, eating out, that'd be fine because I always do it anyways. But y'all, I'm so tired of it. Especially when you eat out for breakfast, lunch, and dinner in one whole day. Mm-mm. Ain't gonna happen. But I do try to keep like some groceries and things in my car. It just get kind of hectic because in my cooler, I put ice in mine because I don't have like a cooler that keeps like cool or whatever. You still have to put ice. I don't have a refrigerator. I have a freaking cooler. So I still have to like change out my ice and everything. So that becomes hectic. So I try to typically get foods that I don't have to keep cool or keep warm. And if I have to keep it, you know, somewhat cool, it's cold outside. So that's still, you know works out for me too so yeah so i don't want this video to be too long and plus i gotta go into work and i need to eat my food but yeah so for the next month what i am going to do is starting today i am going to track how much money i am spending as far as food um as far as and as as far as food and as far as gas because i want to see how much money am I really spending in these areas and see how I can minimize it to a certain extent. So um I think this is gonna help me in the long run in the long run for you know the following months to come. So I'm definitely gonna do that. Also, I just want to recognize all my new subscribers. Thank you guys so very much for subscribing to my channel. I really, really appreciate it. Like, I really do. You guys just don't understand. Like, I really appreciate it, you guys. And everyone that's, like, giving me helpful um, tips on different things that I can do to um, better my journey. Again, thank you guys so very much. It's been, like, really helpful for you, girl. And I really do appreciate it. So... Thank you guys so much for staying tuned and watching my video today. I really, really appreciate it. Don't forget to like and subscribe and also hit the bell notification button so you guys can keep up with my upcoming videos. Again, thank you so much. And always remember, vibe ain't peace. Bye.